Hello engineers and welcome back to Civil Nirman. Today we are diving into a common sad warning message that might have caught your attention. And the warning is sulfate is more than the total weight of all the structural element in a particular load case with specific direction. Sounds technical right? Don't worry by the end of this video you'll understand exactly what this message means and how to handle it with ACE. So let's get started. So why STAT gives you this warning? Well this feature was introduced because of an important enhancement in STAT. See in the earlier versions of the STAT it didn't allow assigning self-weight to the specific list of members but now we can assign self-weight to the selected members or groups. See, this flexibility sometimes lead to mistakes like missing out on the assigning self-weight or assigning self-weight multiple times to the same members. To help users catch such issues, STAT checks the applied self-weight for any inconsistency. Now let's break down this particular with an example. Imagine your structure has a total self-weight, we call it x, let's say 10 kN. Now let's define three load cases, let's say load case 1 in which we will apply self-weight in the y direction load case number six uh, in which we will apply self-weight in the z direction and for your understanding i am creating another load case stand where we will apply again self-weight in the z direction repeatedly and finally we will create a repeat load case like this you can check out this particular syntax Now here is what happens, see STAT checks all the load cases contributing self-weight in the Z direction. Now let's say for this particular load case, it notice that self-weight is applied twice in the Z direction, one from load case number 6 and again from load case number 10. Now see, STAT calculates the total self-weight in the Z direction ignoring any factors. So instead of 10 kN, our structure self-weight, it sees 20 kN applied in the Z direction. Now see, this mismatch triggers the warning, applied self-weight is more than the total weight. Now let's simplify the process, STAT follows to check this. So in step 1, it calculates the total self-weight of the structure. In step 2, it checks all the load cases for the self-weight commands, sums them up call this as let's say y and compare this y with the x so in our example let's say we have assumed that it has 10 kN weight let's say the structure weight is x as 10 kN and for load case 113 it calculates y as 20 kN now because load cases 6 and 10 both applied self weight in the z directions and since y is greater than x stead flags this as a warning to alert you now see here is the important part this is is not an error the analysis will still run correctly stat is simply warning you to double check your inputs so if this is intentional and you are certain that the self weight is correctly applied you can safely ignore the warning but if it's unintentional you may need to revisit your load cases to remove the duplicate self weight assignments so here are few quick tips to avoid this warning number one use the print static check command to verify your load calculation second check for or overlapping self-weight assignments in your input file and third remember that for repeat load cases stat ignores the load factors while calculating this warning see understanding how stat works behind the scenes will make you more confident user and that's it for today's video i hope this cleared up any confusion about stat self-weight warning now if you found this video helpful give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing more for stat tips and tricks remember don't just learn software learn concepts thank you